Hello everyone. Today we are talking about the latest Ultimaker Cura release, version 5.1. With this release, owners of Ultimaker printers can expect better supports, improved service quality, and best of all, a whole new host of new Metal FFF printing capabilities. Let's dive into the new Metal features first. 5.1 added a shrinkage plate that is automatically generated when printing with compatible ultrafuse metal materials. This plate prevents your part from deforming during debinding and sintering. We also added supports for the new DD 0.4 support core and the new ultrafuse support layer material, both of which come in the recently announced metal expansion kit. When used with the DD core, the support material is used to print an interface layer between your metal part and the metal supports, which make it easier to remove the supports after sintering. Our next exciting improvement is that the segment resolution of prints have been massively increased when printing on S-Line printers using the latest firmware. The result is improved surface quality on models that have smooth curves like spheres, cones and cylinders. The way supports are generated when using Ultimaker PVA and Ultimaker Breakaway support material have also been improved. Supports will no longer print with an outer wall and are also created using zigzag structure. As a result, supports will print as much as 20% faster and will be more reliable. Supports will also leave less defects in the areas where they connect to your print, meaning that the surface quality of your final prints will be better. Additionally, the new structures mean that PVA supports will dissolve faster, especially when using the Ultimaker PVA removal station. We've also streamlined the slicing process when using intent profiles. A new UI means that it's now easier and more straightforward to select your print settings. Also, if you want to customize the standard intent profiles, an updated tooltip will remind you that settings have been changed. Next, we've made it easier to collaborate when using 3MF project files. When loading a 3MF file into Ultimaker Cura that uses a material profile that you do not currently have, you will now be prompted to download and install any missing profiles. Finally, print profiles for the new colors of Ultimaker Tough PLA have been added, so you can now enjoy printing one of our most popular materials in yellow, blue and grey. Thanks for watching, subscribe for future updates and have fun printing with Ultimaker Cura 5.1.